This is amazing. This is awesome right here. It has the six piston brakes, the wide body fender flares. We saw one at the dealership and it was narrow body and it just, it didn't do it justice. But this, this guy's right here. If you want something special right here, this is a nice looking 392. Hey, is this color specific to the 50? Yo, is this color specific to the 50? Look at the look to the wheels, guys. This is hard. This is hard. This gives B5 Blue a run for its money. Yo, this gives B5 Blue a run for its money. Yeah. Look at the stance on this, guys. Satin wrapped um, hood. Hey, it came wrapped? It came everything. Wow, everything. nice. Everything. The only hood thing pins, that guys. Somebody did, yo, I forgot just now. My, what's his name? Brian called and said somebody was on the phone like they called the cops. So, that's what it was. Oh, you know what? Those guys are so screaming. Yeah. A few minutes later. Look at this, guys. Look how awesome this looks. Jesus Christ, look at the insert on that carbon fiber right there. At least I think that's carbon fiber. And look at the uh, bronze stitching to match the bronze 50 right there. This thing is amazing. Oh, it's, oh appreciate it, man. This, this is awesome. This, this, this is awesome. Yo, look how look how amazing this is, guys. Let me know what you think about this. This looks crazy. I really like this pattern on the radio and the um the, the center console and everything and the dash. This is amazing right here. We have the Alcantara and leather inserts right there with the bronze stitching. This is awesome. This, this is nasty right here. Yeah, that that was I did not like that. That was weak. Yeah, yeah, that narrow body was weak. Yeah. But see, what's crazy is, is when they, when, when, when they announced the 50th edition, they only showed it in wide body form. Exactly. So when I saw it at the dealership, I was confused. I was like, what is this? You can get it in RT. Okay, you can get it in wide body. You can get it in a... Uh... The painted shaker right here, guys. That's definitely different on the 50th. Usually it would come a uh, satin black. See guys, the badge on the 50th edition is also different as well. It's uh, more muted, so it's like a gray, where like the regular one would be colored with like a yellow and a red and black and stuff like that. Is this a, oh, it's numbered, that's right, it's numbered. So guys, just so you guys don't know, make sure this is a real 15th edition car. This is 21 out of 70. Damn, that's a low number, man. So just so you guys know, if you guys do not see this, in the 50th edition, it is not real. <laughs> Seriously, because you know how there's people out there that's going to try and, you know, copy and fake, you know what I mean? Yeah, this is great. This is great right here. This is the wide body 50th edition RT Scat Pack, man. Hey, um, these wheels are specific to the, of this car, right? They're nasty. It just looks like, it just looks clean. It just looks clean, like. And the gunmetal calibers? Yeah, it just looks. Yeah, it look. It just looks, Um, it looks very classic. You know what I mean? So another Hellcat right here, guys. If, if you don't mind me asking, though, what year is this? 16. 16. Guys, you got, um, and what type of intake is this? B Woody. B Woody, B Woody intake. Um. I'm thinking you were revving it earlier, but I wasn't around. Apparently the uh, the wine sounds way louder on this. This is um, the granite color, right? The granite color. It's a nice car right here, man. You walk around the car and show you guys real quick. Hey, brother. 
Um, so what all do you have done to it? Uh, it's a pre-Eagle 5705 Magnum. Uh-huh. It has a 494 lift cam, on two headers, no cats, uh, SLP loud mount one exhaust, 391 jig rag, rear end, 3200 stall. That's pretty much about it. Wow. Tuned by Jay Green. It ran 126 with the stock cam in the quarter. I don't know what it runs now. Just yeah, I see a lot of Mopars going to Jay Green. Yes. Yeah, I see a lot of Mopars. I might be considering it because I really do want it to. If you have a Hemi, that's the man. Yeah, I'm the uh, Destroyer Grey Challenger right there with the lights. Yes, yes, that's, that's awesome. So if you want the tune from Jay Green, you got to get the Diablo. And you get a guy to get an unlocked PCM and then you go yeah, I'm, I'm to him. Okay. You send him an email? That's a mail. I want to say email. Yeah, everything's by email. Yeah. Everything's by email. He's super responsive. Best customer service out there. He does. I think he just like, he do a lot of things. He has me driving yep. the car and do a couple of poles in there. Yeah, we just put a, I just put a cam in this one. And he's been trying to get this dialed in for the last couple of days. Interesting. You'll love it once you get that Jay Green tune. You'll love it. Once you get the job on your lock, you see me going to get some power. And when you get the green tune on top of that, you're like, wow. Wow. Yeah, it looks nice. 